and see Eurometer 120. Main characteristics of Eurometer 120. Auto calibration with power on. Simple and excellent compatibility by USB communication port. Enhancing user convenience even for left-hander by ergonomics design. Enhancing work efficiency by flexible options between quick mode and normal mode. Easy to input multiple ID by keyboard, PC and barcode reader. Application to your multi-language by MIDI PC. 4 to 11 parameter testing available. Maximum 300 tests per hour. Average 120 tests per hour. Easy to learn and operate. Names of each part. System installation and measurement. Turn on the power switch at the rear of Eurometer 120. System checking and calibration will be performed automatically and standby mode will be shown. Press enter key and loading plate will appear. You can choose a measurement mode between quick mode and normal mode. Press enter key at standby mode once for quick mode. For normal mode, press it twice. In normal mode, you can adjust the time, but you need to consider reaction time at least one minute. You can have test results according to setting time. Press zero key at standby mode for setting time. You can adjust the time. Press escape key to return to standby mode. In quick mode, you can have test results in three seconds without setting time. Dip a strip in fresh urine sample for a few seconds and take it out. Remove excess urine by letting the side part of strip contacting the soft tissue directly. Lay a strip on the strip loading plate. Test results will be shown according to set mode. When you finish the test, remove the strip from the plate. Press enter key to return to standby mode. The black line on the strip should be completely dipped in urine. When you dip a strip in urine sample, make sure that all parameters on strip are completely dipped in. Some system errors can occur when excessive urine is not completely removed. cleaning. Pull the tray in the arrow direction. Clean the tray with running water and a soft cloth. Dry it completely. You may use alcohol to clean. Clean the tray every day if possible. If you are right or left-handed, change the direction of the plate for your convenience. As you see, Take off the tray and put it in the opposite direction. Then the mode will be changed automatically. 
Avoid the direct sunlight while operating Eurometer 120 for exact results of the test. Reaction time should be considered both in quick and normal mode. In quick mode, you should start the test at least in one minute after dipping a strip in urine sample. In normal mode, you should start the test at least in five seconds after dipping a strip in urine sample. Make sure that excessive urine is completely removed. Make sure that the strip set in Eurometer 120 and the strip that you are using is the same type. Printing paper. Open the cover. Remove used paper and load printing paper as you see on the video. In two seconds, the instrument recognizes the printing paper and initiates the paper's right position automatically. System control. In standby mode, press escape key twice and system control menu will be shown. System clock set for setting time. System configuration for setting operation system. Registration for inputting ID. Database for using saved data. Database block control for calling back saved data and printing out. In system control mode, press one key and system clock set mode will be shown. In system clock set mode, move to each item by using up or down keys and adjust the time by using left or right keys. Press escape key to return to system control mode. In system control mode, press two key and system configuration mode will be shown. You can move to each item by using up or down keys and you can select by using left or right keys. Beep sound enable. Beep sounds while operating each test whenever you select yes. Set baud rate, PC. The speed rate can be selected while transferring data between Eurometer 120 and PC bilaterally. At normal condition, 115.2 should be selected. Set display unit. Set the unit of test results between mole and milligram. Strip type. Select the strip type you want among SD4 to 11. Select language. Select one language among five languages of English, French, German, Spanish, and Italian. Only the name of parameter will be changed according to selected language on printing paper or on LCD display. Printer enable. Printer on or off by selecting yes or no. If you select yes, test results will be shown on both LCD and printing paper. DIS IO count. This is for displaying the number of loaded and analyzed strips on LCD with a large character. When you finish selecting all conditions, press escape key. If there is no change from last conditions, you will return to system control mode. But if there is any change, a question to confirm changed conditions will be shown on the display as you see on the video. Select yes and press enter key and system control mode will be shown. In system control mode, press three key and registration mode will be shown. You can enter operator's ID, lot number of strip and patient samples ID. But when you enter them in registration mode, you must change the setup to hidden function 980. You can enter patient's samples ID by using numeric keys or a barcode reader or by using up or down keys to move to part A. If you want to change patient's samples ID you input, you can return to ID mode using up or down keys and enter new patient samples ID again.
Part B is a serial number of sample you are going to test. Part C is number of data that will be stored in database after measurement. Press escape key to return to system control mode and do the test again using strip. In system control mode, press 4 key and database mode will be shown. In part C, enter the data's number you want to input. You can move to each item by using up or down keys. Press enter key. You can view the data's test result on LCD display. You can print out the result on the display by pressing enter key again. A. Shows the time of measurement. B. Shows the strip type. C. Shows data's number saved in database. D. Shows the number of ID. Database can save up to memory of 2,000 test results. When the memory is full of 2,000 test results, all data will be transferred to main PC automatically if PC and the Eurometer 120 instrument are connected through RS-232C cable. If they are not connected, previously saved data will be erased on the first in, first out basis. In system control mode, press 5 key and database block control mode will be shown. You can upload the data of test results to PC through RS-232C. The data form uploaded is the same as paper printing style. Uploading mode is for transferring data of the test results to PC in a lump. Data input can be made by pressing numeric keys or left or right keys. Press enter key to operate a system. Printing mode is for printing data of test results in a lump. You can input data, pressing numeric keys or left or right keys, and press enter key to operate a system. The printer capacity is limited to 50 test results at one time. After all data processing is finished completely, a sign of OK Finish will appear on the screen. If database is empty, an error sign of no data in database will appear at the center of display and go back to previous mode. You can choose two kinds of cables between RS-232C and USB cable. If you use RS-232C cable to connect to your PC, you can send data via the serial port without program installation. If you want to connect USB cable to your PC, you need to install a program to read USB cable in your computer. Visit our website www.standardia.com for this program. Barcode Reader Connect Barcode Reader to COM2 of Eurometer 120 at rear. First of all, press hidden number 980 in system control mode. You can see LCD display change as on the video. Press Enter key to change Display Enable and Auto Ink Enable to Display Disable and Qto Ink Disable. Press Escape to return to System Control Mode. In System Control Mode, select three key. In Registration Mode, enter ID by using up or down keys to move to ID input part or using numeric keys. You can enter Serial ID. You can also input letters by using Barcode Reader. If you want to change ID, press left or right keys to move to the number you want to change and correct it by using keyboard or barcode reader. Press escape key and standby mode will be shown. Start the test again. Precaution. Avoid the direct sunlight while operating Eurometer 120 for exact results of the test. Reaction time should be considered both in quick and normal mode. In quick mode, you should start the test at least in one minute after dipping a strip in urine sample. In normal mode, 
You should start the test at least in five seconds after dipping a strip in urine sample. Make sure that excessive urine is completely removed. Make sure that the strip set in Eurometer 120 and the strip that you are using is the same type. 